video we're going to show you how to change a broken mini blind. And as you can see right here, we've taped it and there's a piece here. So first thing you're going to do is there are some extra pieces under here. We're going to end up using them. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn this over. You might have some tabs, so we're going to remove these little tabs. And these are the little tabs underneath. On this blind, I have three of them. But you're going to see the one on the right, and in this case, the one on the far left, have strings going through them, and the one in the middle does not. So we're only going to have to remove the two end tabs. So you only need to remove the ones that have the center string. Now I'm gonna get under here. You can use what works best is a flathead screwdriver. You can get under there with your fingernails as well or your pliers and you're gonna pull that tab out. First thing you're gonna notice is this jumbled up piece. And then on the inside of the blind, you're gonna see, you're gonna see a string. We're gonna pull that out and then we're gonna unknot this. And then once that is unknotted, we're gonna find our blind that's broken and we're just gonna pull that string up and through. And then you're gonna repeat the same thing on the other side. So we'll come over here and do the exact same thing. We'll pull that up and through the other side. So next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna come, we're gonna pull our blind out and we're gonna slide the broken piece out. And that one's garbage. Next, there's extra pieces down at the bottom. We're gonna grab one of those pieces. We're gonna slide it through. Make sure you get it through the right slot. And it'll sit right, and we're gonna restring that. First go through, I see that there's actually another one right here that's cracked. So I'm actually gonna pull this up since I have it undone. It's just a few strings higher. And I'm going to remove this one as well. You can see the crack there. We're going to grab another one of the spare pieces. And we'll slide that through. And then you're going to check through your blinds. There's no other broken pieces, which there are not. And then you're gonna come back down here and you're gonna take your thicker cord that was through the middle and we're just gonna restring that. Now we're gonna take our cord and we're just gonna restring it through the middle of all of these blinds. You can bunch them up into groups. I just did two. Just make sure this one's upside down. Make sure they're all facing the same direction. through three of them at once. So you can do multiples and we'll get that all the way to the bottom. So now we've gotten it through all of the blinds. They're all the same way. We're gonna push it through this last hole. And in this case, it's really hard. Um, this has been melted, so it's a little bit thicker than the hole. So you may have to go through and expand this hole. So you could use a drill here. I'm just using this needle and those pliers. And I'm just gonna poke it in there spin it around. This is plastic, so it'll expand the size of that hole. And then from there, it should be a little bit easier to poke through. And then I'm just going to loop it up and make that same knot that was there before. Come it around. I'm just going to take that, loop it around, poke it through the hole, and pull it tight. And that's one side, and we'll go to the other side. So again, we have this. We're going to try to push it through. This one might push through okay. And it did, so I didn't have to expand the hole. Here it is on the other side. We're just gonna pull that tight. You can see where the last loop knot was. We're just gonna try to get that into the same spot. We're gonna make sure all these strings are tucked back into place. We're gonna put our cap back on. And then we're going to do the same thing to the other side. Push this in. Make sure these strings are spun up. Shove them in. Push your cap back on. So now we've removed these two broken ones. We've replaced it with two new ones on the bottom. The last step is to pull your blinds open. Make sure they work. 
drop them down, make sure everything's going. And they're all normal. And then we're also going to try spinning them to make sure they all spin. And they do. And that's how you fix a broken mini blind slat. Hopefully this helps. And as always, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.